Today we're going to be showing you how to replace the motor core and the torque sensor on your Surface 604 bicycle. First thing we need to do is remove the battery and then power down the bike. The screen may or may not light up, we're just making sure the power is out of the system. Now we'll want to disconnect the power cable. Next with a 18mm uh, wrench, we're going to loosen off the axle nuts. Same thing on the opposite side. The drive side nut may need to be completely removed to clear the uh, derailleur. Once you have it backed up enough, you should be able to do this by hand. Once the wheel is removed, take note of the configuration of your spacers and your washers. The wheel needs to be reinstalled the same way you took it apart. From here, we'll need to take our freewheel removal tool. Then we'll install your chain whip. and remove the freewheel. Next step is to remove the uh, plate of the motor body. We'll need a hollow tipped torque bit and uh, remove the bolts, all six of these. Once you remove the six bolts, we're then going to turn the wheel around and we're going to tap on the opposite side. As you can see, that's starting to break free. You'll need to remove the bolts or the nuts on the opposite side. Again, keeping in mind the configuration of your washers. And there you go. And just pay attention to how the configuration is of the washers. Using the same process, removing the bolts of the new core, you'll want to remove it and get it ready for install into your hub. Okay, at this point we want to make sure that the planetary gear system in the new hub um, is removed to be put into the existing hub. Um, keep in mind there's a small spacer here that will be fitting in the inside. Keep an eye on this spacer to make sure that it's uh, put back in when reassembling. You can place it on a bench and tap with a mallet. Once you have the planetary gear hub out, keep in mind not to lose the two spacers on the outside. We're now ready to start the reinstall of the new motor core. Um, we want to make sure that the spacer is in the right spot on the axle and that this aligns with the slot on the planetary gears when fitting it in. like so. And then your two washers on the back side. Now we're ready to install the new motor car that's assembled into the existing hub. 
once you're close to getting it in, you may have to wiggle to help the planetary gears fit and line up with themselves. Once the gears are aligned and everything's snug, we're then ready to fasten the six bolts back in place. Before we reinstall the wheel, we'll be replacing the torque sensor, which is located at the drive side of the frame above the derailleur, and we'll need to remove the derailleur and the three bolts that are mounting it. Then we'll remove the derailleur and then these three bolts. Okay. okay. We're going to need to unplug the old wire and then we're going to reinstall the, uh, the new torque sensor. And then we're going to reinstall the rear derailleur. The hanger is built right into the torque sensor. There we go. We're going to reconnect the wires, making sure the arrows are lined up. Next step is to reinstall the cassette, lining up the larger spacer on the free hub body with the larger space on the cassette. Slide the cassette on, lining up the wide slots. And then the remaining cogs in the same configuration. And then the last is the lock ring, which we can start by hand. And we'll uh, tighten this down with the free wheel tightening tool. Putting the wheel back into the frame, we want to make sure that the spacer configuration on the axle is the same at which it came out. And then we'll carefully line things up. We're just doing our best to line up the rotor into the caliper. Once you have it lined up, we're then just going to finger tighten temporarily. We're going to reinstall the washer and the nut over the power wire, making sure the washers are in on the inside in the same configuration in which they came out. And we're just going to finalize the tightening with a wrench on both sides. And now we're going to reconnect the power, lining up the arrows. And now we're ready to reinstall the battery. And now powering up for the moment of truth. And now we're ready to ride.